coming to you from the Deep South. This is the Blue Collar Leadership Podcast. High impact leadership is not reserved for leaders, and it has nothing to do with your position, title, or rank. However, it does have everything to do with your character. It's time to climb to the next level and beyond, personally and professionally. Now, let's start making it happen with your host, Max Story. So I got a little fired up yesterday. I want to pick up where I left off. I got excited talking to you guys about that quote I learned or heard a long time ago and stuck with me. If we want to invest in ourselves, why should someone else? You see, most of the time, especially people at work, what I've heard so often throughout my career and even while I've been consulting and speaking and training is people, I hear them say, well, if my, I would go, but my company won't pay. And what we have to understand is if we invest in ourselves, others will match us. That's what happens when people, a lot of times they go get a technical degree or a four-year degree. They go invest in themselves, time and money. Sometimes it's somebody else's money, but it's always their time. So they invest in themselves. And then usually if they have the experience or sometimes with no experience, organizations will match them. And that's where they get hired for for the degree they have. But you don't have to have a degree. That's the one thing I want everyone out there in the blue collar world to know. Unless you want to be a doctor or some type of professional, a lawyer or or teach at a university, and most blue-collar folks don't want to do that, so you don't need a degree. My son doesn't have a degree, and he makes more in a month than than, than a lot of people make in a year, and uh, he's 27 years old, no college. He's been earning right at six figures or, or over six figures, and he's well over six figures now ever since he was 19 years old, and he's done nothing but read leadership development, personal growth books, and and I invested in him when he was uh, 21 and got him certified through some different leadership programs. And he's done a lot more. He reads and studies a lot of stuff. I don't even know that he does. But that's that's what I want to talk to you about here in this, this, this episode is how to invest in yourself. At a minimum, you don't have to spend any money. You're always going to have to invest time. But you can get on the Internet. You can go to my LinkedIn uh, account. I've got over 250 articles on there. A lot of them are chapters from my books. And I'm not the only one that does that. A lot of people do that. So you can get online. You can you can get uh, tons of videos from YouTube. Lots of stuff. You can get audios, podcasts, just like this one. There's a lot of other people doing podcasts. You can do all of that stuff for free. But I encourage you to to, to get into reading books. And I hate to read but I've been reading every day for 10 years. What I figured out is I, I like to learn more than I hate to read. And the degree that you invest in yourself is going to determine where you go. It's going to determine your value. You'll hear me talk on a, a later episode some point. We shouldn't be focus on, don't focus on becoming successful, focus on becoming valuable. And you do that by developing yourself. That, that quote that I love so much from Mark Twain says, I, I, I never let my schooling interfere with my education. And that's a big deal because what he's talking about, we educate ourselves, K through 12, technical college, uh, four-year universities, those type things where you go get your bachelor's and master's and doctorate degrees, all that's your schooling your formal schooling, but your real education, especially in the blue collar workforce, much of it comes from on the job training. That's where you learn a lot of skills and abilities and that sort of stuff. But you can maximize and leverage that if you'll focus on your mindset, not just your tool set and skill sets. And you can do that through the reading, the videos, the audios that I've been touching on. And if you read my books, they're full of quotes. So you can find tons of other people to go read besides my stuff. I've got a lot of stuff. I keep it simple. My books are 30 chapters, three pages each. So it's easy for people to read. You can read a chapter in six or seven minutes, but they're full of quotes and stuff that I've collected and captured over time. So I just want to make sure 
did you know five minutes a day, 30 seconds a day, do something every day. And as my friend Derek Brown says, five minutes a day goes a long way. And that's the truth. So invest in yourself, time, money, whatever it takes. I started going to conferences later and spending ten thousand, tens of thousands of dollars, over $100,000. So there's lots of things to do, but you don't have to spend any money. But if you get gung-ho at some point, you're probably going to want to do like I did and go to conferences and, and see people. And those tickets usually are anywhere from 99 to 500 $600 for a day. You may be thinking, that's crazy. I used to think that was crazy until I started doing it. But I'm getting crazy results. You do crazy things, the right crazy things, you can get crazy results. So I'm going to stop here today. Most of my podcasts are going to be short, so I can try to keep them rolling out every day. You guys have a great day. I'll talk to you next time. Make it happen or someone else will. It might as well be you. Are you serious about taking your career and your life to the next level and beyond? Check out Max Story's Blue Collar Leadership Series books and others, now available on audio, along with paperback and ebooks at Amazon, iTunes, and Audible. Please visit bluecollarleadership.com to learn about Max books, programs, special offers, certifications, and more. Thank you for listening to the Blue Collar Leadership Podcast.